situation. But for about the past year, he's been lost out here on this island. One of the ways that we're trying to catch Sirocco is by putting out some tuckable pellets in a hopper with the hope of attracting something. So we've got this hopper set up here, and across from it we've got a trail cam that will detect if the birds come to eat from the hopper during the night. We can cross-reference that footage with this data logger, which will read the transmitter of the tuckable so we know who it is that's been feeding. Sirocco currently doesn't have a functioning transmitter, so if we see a bird on the trail cam and the data logger doesn't pick it up, it could be who we're looking for. Our night searching last night wasn't very successful, which was a bit disappointing. We covered a fair bit of the island, but we did have this bit of good news. We're here at one of the hoppers that we set up yesterday, and we found that some of the pellets have been spilled out underneath the hopper which tells us that something's been eating from here. Uh, we checked our data logger and that tells us that none of the birds with the functional transmitters have been here. We're yet to check the trail cam footage. Once we go back to the hut and have a look at that, we should get a good idea of who's been eating from here. Fingers crossed. All right, so we're just gonna have a look at that trail cam footage from last night. Oh. We definitely have a kakapo at the feeder, which is fantastic news. We don't believe that they have a working transmitter on them, so that's probably Sirocco. Awesome, that's really good news. Oh, that's great. Yeah, gives us a target for tonight. This is really quite frustrating. We had sign of them within the first couple of days, but then we ended up just on a sort of wild goose chase across the island. Quite often we we're, were doing things called stakeouts where we just sit extremely still, uh, not making any noise near a place where we suspect he might turn up. Well, it's day five of the hunt for Sirocco. We've been out staking out some of the hoppers for the past couple of nights with no luck so far. So we're trying out a few new things today. We're moving the hoppers around the island. We're setting out some of these pieces of apple see if he'll be walking along the path and have a go at them. Hopefully we'll be in luck. The two of us were headed to stake out a food hopper we'd set up for him. Sarah had taken up her position a wee way down the track and I carried on to my position and lo and behold when I got there um, Sirocco was just sat on the track next to the food. I didn't wait around to see who it was. Didn't know it was Sirocco at the time. I just dropped my gear and, and grabbed the bird as quickly as I could. You can see we have a bird in the bag. Sorry, I didn't film the catching, but it was kind of unexpected. <laughs> just came walking along, is about to stake out this hopper that's just over here. And lo and behold, there's a bird sat right there as I was walking up. Alright, so we got our bird and we are gonna put a transmitter on him, give him a full health check, and see how he's been doing out here on his own for so long. Kakapo self, so we're pretty happy with how he's doing and we'll leave him here.